What is up, YouTube? It is Mr. Egotting here, and uh, I hope you guys like my new intro. Um, it's made by Kaloxify. His channel will be in the description, and he's really good at making intros and things of that nature with Cinema 4D, Photoshop, the whole, the whole package. So uh, go check out his channel if you're interested in uh, editors and stuff like that. But um, today it is Sunday Demolition. 43 and 3 with the M16. Don't see a lot of M16 gameplay, so I decided to use this gun, which I found very helpful. Um, it's really consistent with its range and accuracy, but it is not consistent with damage. Sometimes it takes two hits, sometimes it's three to four hits, or three to four bursts. So, yeah. And um, it's actually my 50th video, so um, that's a little, it's not really a milestone, but kind of a big deal in the YouTube community. So, since it's my 50th video and it's Sunday Demolition, I decided to share a life story that was really embarrassing that happened. Um, yeah, it's a pretty embarrassing story. Actually, Cod Chameleon had made a commentary about shitting himself. Mine is similar to that, although I didn't shit myself. I pissed my pants. And that was in fifth grade. So, um, I was about 10 years old. And um, that's pretty embarrassing if you may ask me. Um, I've never done something similar to that except in preschool. And that story I'll share for another time. But pissing yourself in elementary school, especially when you're um, in fifth grade. And fifth grade is the highest grade for elementary school. So you're kind of like the boss of the school and you piss yourself. It's not really that cool. So what had happened was at the beginning of fifth grade... You don't know what your teacher is until the first day of school. And I had got um, Miss Hirschkoff. Miss Hirschkoff was my brother's teacher. And she's an old school teacher. And she's like 50. No, she's like 60. So she's pretty old. Actually, she probably wasn't 60. But she was pretty old. And she was pretty strict. And that day, I believe we had been doing standardized testing. So... Asking to the bathroom wasn't probably the best idea, and I was a little scared back then, especially she's a very intimidating teacher. So, she was sitting at her desk, and we were still doing our standardized testing, and I kept trying to get myself, I was trying to persuade myself to go ask her to the bathroom, and I just couldn't do it. I kept looking at her over at her desk, and she was reading and I just couldn't do it. So every time I got up and she might have looked at me, I just got scared. So pretty much I ended up drinking water. Uh, we had a, we actually had a water fountain in our classroom, which was pretty cool. I never had a water fountain in any, any other any other of my classes, either even in high school, which I kind of realize is now pretty cool. So every time I got up to try to get the balls to ask her, I ended up um, pussing out and instead just drinking water, making the whole thing a lot worse. And I'd probably done that about three or four times. And um, I was probably even more of an idiot, so I didn't even pretend to drink water. I actually drank the water. Uh, so, yeah. And um, so this has happened right before lunch. So I'm thinking I can I can hold this in. I was thinking I can hold this in until lunchtime started, which was at 1230. And I'd been – this was probably one of the – I'll call it an EP. I mean – Cod Chameleon called it ES, I'll call it an EP, an emergency piss. I needed to piss so bad, but I was just too scared to ask my teacher. So I tried my best to wait till 12.30, and I ended up pissing myself probably at about 12.22. So I couldn't even hold it in. Actually, I think it was a minimum day that day, and yeah, and it was raining, so it made it a little bit less uh, noticeable. So what had happened was I pissed myself and the girl that was sitting next to me <laughs> this is one of the funniest parts of the story was a, a a line of piss had just went right down the the chair and uh she looked at it and she gave me one of those looks like what the fuck is that and i was just like oh my god so i was i was hoping that she didn't know what it was um but she could have i don't know so when i got up there was a puddle of, when the bell rang, there was a puddle of pee in my chair. Actually, you know what? It might have been lunchtime. But yeah, there was a puddle of pee in my chair. So what I did was, I pushed in my chair as far as it could go. And I think I was wearing black shorts at the time, so you couldn't tell that I had peed myself. 
but it was pretty wet. So what I had done was I got a sweater and I tied it around my waist and uh, I was pretty much wet for the next two hours and uh, I didn't have any change of clothes or anything and I didn't want to go to the nurse because that would make it more embarrassing to borrow clothes from her. So I pretty much sat in my own piss for about two hours, which was uh, pretty devastating. And um, when the bell rang, it, uh, yeah, I think it was a rainy day. Um, normally I would have go to play basketball, which actually might have made it better. It would have aired it out a little bit. But um, it was raining, so we didn't go out in the rain. What we did was we, we all kind of, everyone in my grade, or actually pretty much everyone at the school, we were all just standing under the the balcony along the side of the, the the classrooms. So I was just leaning up against the wall with my backpack um, on my crotch and my sweater on my butt. So um, pretty much trying my best to cover up the pee. And I think that girl that saw the pee running down the chair was probably the only one that noticed. So I was super slick about it. And um, I don't even remember what my mom said. I don't even remember if I told her. And actually, in elementary, I didn't wear underwear, so I only wore started wearing boxers when I got in like halfway through fifth grade. So I don't even know if I had boxers on; it just might have been straight up shorts. But yeah, that's pretty much the story of me uh, pissing myself. And um, if you guys have any feedback, let me know. It's fiftieth video, and also I had recorded a Wings of Redemption parody. Um, I decided not to upload it because I didn't think it was that funny. But if you guys are in really interested in seeing it, I will make another one. I could either do Wings of Redemption, Tabe, Hutch, pretty much any of your famous commentators. Just tell me. I'm pretty funny, but I'm not, I don't do the best impressions. But uh, if you're interested in any of those, just comment and tell me what you like. And I noticed I've been getting a lot of good feedback on my video, so I really like that, that I have active and loyal loyal subscribers. So uh, thanks a lot, guys, and be looking forward to my next few videos coming out. And uh, don't forget to like, comment, rate the video. Um, yeah, so uh, peace out, guys, and I'll leave you with about 20 seconds of gameplay. Peace.